Hi guys, this is Navin from Bangalore. Today I am going to teach how to design one simple chemical structure using ChemSketch. Okay, yeah, in my previous video I showed how to install ChemSketch software using Wine software in Ubuntu environment. First, uh, I just open ChemSketch software here. Oh uh, yeah, it's just opened. Just open this software and I will keep it this in left side. Now what we required is one simple one chemical structure uh, so that we can design that in my cam sketch window. I open one simple cam sketch one chemical structure. I will keep it here. You can see one particular image showing both hexagonal and pentagonal structure in that in that and consists of various type of stereo bonds along with double and triple bonds. Now while uh, using this chem sketch, ACD chem sketch lab, it is very easy to uh, draw this type of structure. Just press this window chem sketch. You can see in the left side corner various elements like carbon, hydrogen, nitrogen, oxygen, all those things. And right hand sides, the various chemical structures like hexagonal, pentagonal, and uh, all those stuff. And in the upward direction, you can see the various bonding structures. If you want to extend, you can see here. Here also, we can see various type of bonds. And just go back to that. Yeah. Here is the delete option. If you want to delete that particular structure, if you don't want, then just delete button. And here three options will be there. Once you start designing molecules, then it will appear as in the main pop-up style. Okay, let's guys uh, start that work, particular work using Camp Sketch software. Here, actually in this diagram, they showed one pentagonal structure and also the hexagonal structure and please do observe these type of bonds because it is in the upward direction towards hexagonal side not towards pentagonal side so uh, it is clear that first you have to design pentagonal structure later you add this hexagonal then you can see then you will get this particular type of stereo bond otherwise you won't get this particular type of stereo bonds it will be in the reverse corner okay uh, now I will select pentagonal structure in the right hand side and I will take that one and keep it in the center and because I will have to show you in the clear picture I will increase this window resolution like zoom out it's I kept 150 percent and now you can see clearly yeah just move it a little bit upwards later you required here one hexagonal structure simply go to that hexagonal part and click on that to click le left mouse button and just take till your different carbon atom first carbon atom molecule if you touch that structure into your uh, the original pentagonal structure it will show various if you touch that particular bond structure bond area it will show it will closely attach to that but we don't require such type of structure we requires only the hexagonal structure uh, uh, between two bonds yeah i will just press on carbon atom and keep it here yeah you can see it's the structure it's quite similar to the actually image what I got okay, then I will take stereo bonds here two types of stereo bonds are there here we required uh, it's some gaps will be there okay, I will choose this one and press on that particular bond it will becomes yeah you can see here otherwise what happened is if I take direct first hexagonal structure and later I will add pentagonal structure we will see what happens I took actually I taken that hexagonal structure and I will keep it here and later I will put pentagonal structure to that 
Yeah. Actually, you see, you can see the same structure both, but there is difference. Uh, it will lead to the entire structural changes of that particular chemical. I will take now. You see, I will take the stereo bond and just click on that bond. It will be the quite full reverse. What I didn't expect. Yeah, I need uh, this one left side image, not right side chemical structure. So if I don't want this one, just I will take here select option. Just click on that and press delete button. Yes, it's gone. <laughs> Okay guys, now concentrate on this particular structure, what we need, how to design this molecule and take another stereo to this side, this corner and we require strong stereo bond. Okay, I will keep it here. Later we require double bonds in the various regions. Okay, I will take draw normal bonds and just press on that particular carbon atom and it will show if you want double bond or triple bond just press on that button sorry not button it's the bonding area it will show whether it is uh, holds good for double bonds or triple bonds or single bonds only required there it will based on that particular elements valency it will adjust that particular region later take here double bonds and here also to take wherever you want bonds you just press on that particular carbon atom then it will be easy to go yeah here you can see just once I just click on that particular carbon it will show two bonds at a time uh, but in my structure I don't want in this protrusion in this area the bonding structure is absent in this region Whereas in my drawing structure, it will there. Just delete that particular region. Yeah, we get that one. And you can observe if I take this one normal bond and just click on this particular carbon atom, it will show to diversion. Yeah, you can see easily. But in my original chemical structure, it is not there. So I will delete this or two bonds and now I simply select that particular draw normal bond only and just click on this carbon atom and extend this one straightly you can, now you can see one single line it is quite similar to my image yeah now if you want triple bonds just click uh, two times on that yeah and now we record nitrogen and oxygen elements uh, first i will select oxygen instead of carbon i require oxygen so i will press on this one and say simultaneously here and here and also here and also here and also nitrogen and one hydrogen molecule yeah. guys you can see the same replica of that particular chemical compound i draw using chemsketch this chemsketch software is a freeware and it is easy to use and uh, easy to construct that particular chemical bonding structures now if you want to save this particular molecule based on uh, if uh, in various types take uh, go to files and take save as and select the path where you want to uh, save I, uh, if you want to save in the desktop just select on region yeah i choose in desktop and put one name molecule and now you have to 
know which type of format you required for further studies of that particular chem sketch molecule just file of uh, you can see here file and file of type select which option you want to save in this real time i will save in the mdl mol file molecular files uh, i will choose mdl v2000 okay then i will save it okay this is the simplest way how to design chemical structures using cam sketch in ubuntu environment thank you guys thank you for your patience please subscribe my other videos that can be helpful for your further studies how to design and how to convert cam sketch molecules into pdb files protein database files or other parameter files thank you thank you guys